She built a tool for early detection of Parkinson's disease, and now Taco Bell is giving her $25,000, and she's only 18. KNBC 9's Brian Johnson introduces us to this young woman from Lenexa. So you have some pipettes. Erin so Smith proves young people can inspire adults. Yeah, so Armed with the internet and a library, she taught herself how to code and learned she wasn't alone. I really fell in love with the creative process of coding, and I realized that there was a really big lack of resources. So she and a friend created Steminists, feminists interested in science, technology, engineering, and math. They build tech tools to solve community problems like diagnosing Parkinson's disease early. So I've always been a big fan of Back to the Future, um, which is why I was watching the Michael J. Fox Foundation video. A movie about going back in time pushes Erin into her future. She developed face print. Emojis instruct patients, the computer maps their responses, and provides crucial feedback to physicians. She hopes to take her patent to market. I think one of my brothers is watching football and there was a commercial for it and then they told me they're like oh my gosh Aaron check out this scholarship. A $25,000 scholarship from Taco Bell will help. It's sending her to Stanford. She says every child needs to discover their passion. It's all just about finding that unique way that you can contribute to the world um, and work towards hoping to leave something behind that's bigger than yourself. Evidence wisdom comes from young people eager to learn. In Overland Park, Brian Johnson, KNBC 9 News. And congrats to her on all her success. Hopefully it helps a lot of people in the future. I know. Now, Aaron isn't the only recipient. 18-year-old Jesse Payne of Kansas City is a filmmaker and owns his own production company. Jesse also won a $25,000 scholarship from Taco Bell, and he hopes to attend Loyola Marymount University School of Film and TV in the fall.